Have a look at this. Pascal's triangle for resistors. Can you find the total resistance in this circuit that extends all the way from this one ohm resistor to infinity? What does this circuit even mean? We have a one ohm resistor, which is in series with this branch, which is in series with this branch, which is in series with this branch, all the way up to infinity. But these here are parallel branches. Remember, if we were to add two resistors in series, we just add the uh, resistances to find the total resistance. And if we have a parallel branch, we need to use the 1 over r total is equal to 1 over r1 plus 1 over r2 rule. So let's apply this. First of all, because this branch is in series with this branch and the total resistance in here is just going to be 1 over 1 plus 1 over 1 raised to the power of minus 1 plus this parallel branch over here which uh, the total resistance of which will be 1 over 1 plus 1 over a half plus 1 over 1 raised to the power of minus 1 plus uh, let's do one more. Now the next branch will give us 1 over 1 plus 1 over a third ohms plus 1 over a third ohms plus 1 over 1 raised to a power of minus 1. And this will carry on until infinity. Now this infinite sequence will probably be converging uh, if we were to get an answer in ohms. So let's see whether we can make this a little bit simpler. So we're going to have 1 ohm plus, now 1 plus 1 is just going to give me 2, which is raised to the power of minus 1, which uh, will just give me a half plus. Now this over here will give me 1 plus 1, which is 2, plus 1 over a half. Uh, so this here will give me 2 plus 1 over a half is just 2 raised to the power of minus 1 plus. Now let's work out this fraction over here. So uh, 2 plus 2 will just give me, well, 2 uh, plus 1 over a third plus 1 over a third will just give me 2 over uh, one third, and this is raised to a power of minus one. Let's simplify this even further. So over I'm going to have a one plus a half plus now two plus two is just four raised to a power of minus one uh, will just give me one over four plus um, now let's just focus on this expression over here. We're going to have two plus two uh, over a third. So let's simplify this. This will just give me two plus dividing by a fraction is the same as multiplying by the inverse. So this will be equal to two times three. So overall, this will give me eight doesn't it? So this is actually equal to 8 raised to the power of minus 1, which just give me plus 1 over 8. Well, hang on a minute. This is starting to look like an infinite geometric series. This actually is a question from a website that I use all the time with my students called Isaac physics. And uh, it's a fantastic place to learn physics. Um, this is, by the way, not a sponsored video. I generally use this with my students all the time. The way it works is actually you get a point for every single correct answer. And I would prefer not to spoil the fun for everyone and uh, give the correct answer. So you can go ahead and finish this problem. Now, if you enjoyed this video, chances are you're really going to enjoy a problem which is just one mark from the International Physics Olympiad. And you can have a look at it over there.